We made many mistakes after independence. But one of the biggest mistakes we made after independence is letting our railway system go to waste. That is why when I came to office in 2017, I said everything that was possible to be done to revive the railway system in our country, I am going to do it. And I'm going to find the money, I'm going to find the resources to revive the railway system in Ghana. Road transport plays a critical role in propelling development, economic growth and sustainable poverty reduction. The government of Ghana therefore continues to demonstrate its passion of intensifying rail transport infrastructure development to accelerate the transformation, revitalization and modernization of our economy in order to achieve a high and sustained growth. In 2007, the then Ministry of Ports and Habos undertook a feasibility study with the aim of introducing a multimodal freight transport service between Tema and Buipe via the Volta Lake. The study culminated in the signing of a commercial agreement between government and Mrs. Afcon's Infrastructure Limited for the construction of a 97.7 km railway line between the port of Tema and Impakadai in the Isujamai district of the eastern region with connectivity to the Volta Lake. As part of the project, Two existing railway stations, that is, the Tema Habo Station and Tema Industrial Area Station, have been remodeled and modernized. The project includes a modern rail maintenance facility at Tema, equipped with workshop tools and equipment. Some facilities at the maintenance yard include an administration block, operational control center installed with state-of-the-art train management system, warehouses, locomotive and wagon workshops, wash bay system, among others. Additionally, six new railway stations have been constructed and they include the Ashaiman Station, Afienya Station, Shai Hill Station, Doyumu Kodiabe Station, Bong Station, and Joapong Station. The Tema to Impakadai Railway Line forms part of the Ghana to Burkina Faso Railway Line and has the objective to develop a railway interconnectivity from the port of Tema to Ouagadougou to improve the passenger and freight transport and logistics chain on the corridor to accelerate development and economic growth of both countries. Major structures that have been completed as part of the works include 137 culverts, 11 road over bridges, 24 road under bridges, and four other major bridges. Under the project, a 900 meter road over bridge was commissioned by His Excellency the President in December 2022 and the road has since been open to traffic to address the challenge of congestion which is usually experienced along Accra to a Kosumbu route as well as improve the safety of road users. Furthermore, a 300 meter railway bridge over the Volta River between Senchi and Old Akrade has been fully completed.
Test to Runs were successfully performed in August 2022 on the bridge, which is the first of its kind in the West African sub-region, in anticipation for commercial operations when the railway line is fully completed. A transition team is currently in place going through the necessary modalities including training for the operationalization of the new standard gauge railway network. Two railheads are also being constructed as part of the project. One at the Tema port, which connects to the cargo terminals at the port and the other one at the Impacadine terminal, which provides connectivity to the Volta Lake to facilitate the haulage of containerized cargo and other bulk commodities from the southern sector to the northern sector, and further to our neighboring countries of Burkina Faso, Mali, and Niger. The project is being financed under an India Exim Bank credit facility at a total cost of about 447 million United States dollars and the construction works are being undertaken by Afcon's Infrastructure Limited of India.